never been like this I've never been so scared To say hey, say your name every day I'm afraid that you'll hear it and you might not care I've never been in love But this is close enough Daydream, lightning, I think we be Like a force sent from above Ooh. Good morning guys So it is a Tuesday The, I think the 29th I don't know what day I live in the 29th of May and I am currently in Milan so I thought I would vlog this trip um, we've come here for a few days on holiday and then we're going to Como I've come with my husband um, yeah so I thought I would bring you along with me but I have a long story to tell we were actually supposed to go to Capri on holiday so we were f supposed to fly to Naples on Saturday and then go to Capri and spend a week out there we were super excited because we'd been looking forward to this holiday for a really long time but unfortunately we were involved in the BA debacle and we went to Gatwick Airport on Saturday and when we got there they said that all the flights were cancelled um, and we had to go home and there's been loads of drama going on with money getting refunded and loss on hotels and you know all the rest of it so it's been a huge it's least stressful weekend um, but we were so keen to go away because my husband wasn't gonna get kind of days off later on so we really wanted to go away and use this time to go on holiday but we were just like there was just no flights we literally searched everywhere we were on EasyJet we were on Ryanair we we're just hunting down for flights to get to Naples somehow but it was just impossible and in the end we kind of started looking for other destinations and by chance when we sort of given up the search we found some tickets to Milan and we found a beautiful hotel in Lake Como which we're going to be heading to so yeah so in the end we have been able to come on holiday but it's been so stressful and dramatic and last year actually when we were supposed to go on our summer holiday we were going to Bali and we also couldn't fly because my passport didn't have six months validity I think I was short by two days so we were just like oh my god is this literally gonna happen every year but yeah finally we're here and I hope it's gonna be loads of fun so I thought I would take you along with me show you around Milan we're here for just today and then tomorrow we're going to Como we're staying at the Baglioni Hotel in Milan which is super pretty so I'll show you around and do a bit of a room tour later because it's a bit of a mess back there as you can see right now um, but yeah so we're gonna head out now explore the city maybe do a little bit of shopping um, but before that don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you already haven't I upload it twice a week so please Please, please subscribe I would love to have you again on the channel and also hit the little bell next to it so that you get a notification every time I upload and let's head out hey guys it's so warm in Milan We've just headed out I just wanted to show you the hotel look at the beautiful flowers they have at the front of the hotel it's so pretty and it's all the way for it's jasmine flowers and it's for the whole way and it smells so beautiful um, yeah, I'm just gonna show you what the hotel looks from like from the outside so It's a very small hotel, but it's so pretty. It's like an old palace and it's surrounded by flowers It's so stunning I can't help it, I want you I think I've got a crush on you I think I think too So I've just walked into the store. I'm whispering because I can't vlog in here. Um, and that's the first thing I do. I, I see the store and I walk in and I'm just trying on this dress. It seems sort of a balmain style dress, but it's like off shoulder. I really like the top. I don't know if you can see it properly, but the top is really cool. But I'm not so sure about this. It feels a little tight around the bust area. So I don't know, guys. What do you think? Hey guys, so I'm sorry I didn't vlog more inside the store. The fitting room was just so tiny. I tried on one more dress, which was like an off-shoulder one with um, with like golden buttons going through it. And it was nice. I don't know. I wasn't too sure about the fitting. They just were a bit too tight for my taste. I don't like such form-fitting clothes. But let me know what you think in the comments below. I haven't taken it to now. I'm still having a think about it. So we'll see what I do. Um, we're just walking, actually this area is just where our hotel is and we're just walking actually now towards the Milan Cathedral because we're going to go and see that and I believe there is 
lots of other stuff to see around that area. It's like a nice little square, so we're just walking there now. We are now in the Vittorio Emanuel Road, which is, seems to be like the main shopping street. Um, and we're just walking down here because I believe that at the end that you can see there is the Milan Cathedral. Okay, we've now come to Massimo to see and I know you can get this in London but I just walked in. I've tried on this top and I think it looks really nice. I really like it. And I really like these wide trousers. I've been looking for ones for a while. These are huge for me and this is their smaller size so I'm glad I'm not going to be able to take them. I've just tried on this top and I think this one looks really nice. I love the balloon sleeves, super on trend so I think I'm going to take this one. So I've just come into Sephora guys because it's a mandatory visit. I just saw it when we were walking outside and I was like, I need to step in. So I'm just gonna have a browse and see what I can find. Come to Vittorio Emanuel Galleria. Um, it's so beautiful. I've been here before, but every time I see it, it's just so stunning. And we've just stopped here to have lunch at a plate which is called um, Savini. Sorry, I was just checking the name on the menu. And it's so nice, it's here in the gallery. We're sitting outside, but the gallery is sort of covered anyway. And yeah, we're gonna have some lunch and then we're gonna go see the cathedral, hopefully, because we've made way too many stops. I did do some sneaky purchases in Sephora. And this little bag came. I've got a few masks that I'm super excited to try out, but I just had to. I mean, I saw Sephora and I just had to walk in. So I'll show you what I got when I get back to the hotel. I wanna take you home. I wanna tear your clothes. Lice and heart pound. I lost your found. Whenever you get close, I feel the chemistry. You make it hard to breathe. Need CPR, restart my heart. Cause you've been on repeat. and we've just come here to the museo oh, oops there's like cobblestones on the floor and it's so hard to walk um so we've just come to the pal royal palace it's called palazzo reale and um it, you basically get it in the past that you get to go and see the cathedral so we've come in here to see and they've got such a beautiful courtyard there's a little cafe there in the corner behind me i don't know if you can see that um but yeah we're gonna see this now and then head out and go to the Galleria Vittorio Manuel because I really want to click some pictures there. It is so, so beautiful. Hey guys, so we just finished seeing the museum, which was a bit of a fail to be honest because we couldn't go and see the exhibition. It was way too long and we didn't have enough time today. So we might try and head there tomorrow. And now we're back to Vittorio Emanuel and I'm just taking some pictures. And I'm just going to turn the camera around because it's so beautiful. You guys need to see this. Look at how stunning this is. It's a gallery. All the luxury designer brands are in here, but it is just so, so beautiful. <laughs> It is just so beautiful. I think the architecture is just like so impressive. We've gone to see the inside and it was just something else. You're so stunned when you see it. It's just so beautiful. And then there's this Duomo Square here in the background. It's so nice, I love it. And then there's the Vittorio Emanuel Gallery just in front of me. I'm gonna turn around so you guys can see that. And it's so beautiful. I just love the square. The architecture is stunning. The gallery from the inside is so beautiful. But now we've been around out and about for almost eight hours, so we're super tired. I think we're gonna head back to the hotel and then we're gonna go out for dinner. So yeah, I'll see you in a bit. 
but I think I've got a crush, I got a crush. I think I've so we've just come to the um, bar, the bamboo bar at the Armani Hotel. And it's so pretty, it's super modern. I really like how they've um, done it. And I think we're just gonna sit here, have some dinner, get a drink, and chill out, and then go back to the hotel. Hey guys, so I've just taken my makeup off because as you can probably see from this terrible face, I am super tired. We literally just came back to the hotel for a little bit, had a bit of a rest and then went off to the Yamani Hotel for dinner. But that was really lovely. We had really nice food and some cocktails, so that was super nice. Um, but I think now we're just going to head off to bed because it's about midnight and we are super tired. And we're going to be heading off to Como tomorrow. But before that, I thought I would do a little room tour and show you around my room since we're going to be leaving this hotel tomorrow. Okay, so here, which is where you come in from, we've got this little entryway with some mirrors. And I'm looking very glamorous in my pajamas. <laughs> and then if we turn around here, through here, we have the bathroom. And it's super beautiful. It's like a full marble bathroom. The shower is huge, so it's really nice and really to shower in there. And then here we've got two sinks, which are super nice, and a massive mirror. And then you've got a little mirror there to do your makeup, but I actually do it on this one, and I really have to lean forward because unfortunately I do my makeup without my glasses and I can't really see unless I'm really close up to the mirror. And then we've got some products here which are from Ortiga, they're really nice, they smell really, really good. And then I've got some toiletries there, and then there's this massive shelf underneath where you can store all your toiletries and stuff, which is really nice because there's a lot of storage space. And then we TV over here, and then here we've got a little seating area, which is a bit of a mess because we've got all the shopping there right now. And then a little desk over here with lots of shoes underneath, but that's because I need to pack tomorrow. So yeah, and then here we've got the window and the view is so, so nice. Let me open this. Um, and you can see we've got a beautiful view down here with some shops. And that's where I took some pictures this morning. Very nice street with lots of little stores. So that's it guys, that was my little room tour and I think I'm gonna end this vlog here because next I will be seeing you in Como. So I hope you enjoyed coming around Milan with me. Please don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you already haven't and I will see you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!